In lieu of rising complaints and concerns about PLU sexual misconduct policy, the first sexual assault forum was held today in the Regency Room. With over 100 people in attendance, the forum encouraged dialogue and questions about sexual misconduct at PLU, Title IX at PLU, and other policies in place to protect victims and punish perpetrators. But I was so um, emotionally overwhelmed when I saw how many people were here. It was really, it made me feel so happy that so many people really want to take a stake in this huge issue. I mean, it's really probably the biggest, most impactful problem that we have on campus right now. I think it's a really great start. Um, I think there's definitely more to come, and there should be more to come. But as far as like a first step into answering questions and just raising those questions and making sure those voices are heard, it was a good first step. Attendees spoke in small groups about their thoughts on PLU's policy and response to sexual misconduct. They wrote on pink sticky notes that were designated for comments or thoughts and green sticky notes for questions. These concerns will be addressed at the next forum held Wednesday, April 27th. I'm optimistic. I know uh, so many people's lives won't be the same, but I think this is how we build a culture of people supporting other people, even if this is never part of your story. That students will leave here and go talk to their roommates about what happened here. That faculty will leave here and go talk to their colleagues who weren't here about what happened. That administrators will leave. And that this moment that we shared together will start something much bigger and much longer lasting than just spring semester 2016. That we started a movement, all of us, today.